Today is winter solstice, December 21st, 2021, a day on which our masters do blood rituals with humans. Like on or around winter solstice in 2019, getting the Wu flu into our blood and for this year forcing us the jews into our bloodstream in a huge global winter solstice blood sacrifice ritual in 2015 winter solstice december 21st exactly six years ago and the exact same day as today i left switzerland for good under massive swiss terror forcing me to leave my family and still very young children on this day exactly six years ago a Swiss pink list killer, serial killer, here to the right and Mengele to the left, did a horrifying winter solstice blood ritual on three young children and their mother, making four altogether, spreading the message of the concept of four and three, four square and compass for his Freemason brothers and sisters, also raping one out of three, which all the initiated ones read immediately as once more the concept of three and the concept of four, four square and compass. Like here in this company a logo with a Freemason owner, where there were four cubes and one taken off, just like the Swiss pink list killer, Thomas Nick, on this very day, exactly six years ago, on winter solstice. He had four wicked victims in his hands, of whom he isolated, one to get raped in the good old templar brotherly way an 11 year old boy just as in this freemason company logo of four and three and all the other logos i've shown you so here you can see four which stands for the square um because the square has 90 degrees and with 90 degrees like here you can make a square and um, here on the other side is the freemasons they call this the concept of four one two three four on the other side is the concept of three out of the concept of four so there's one two three which is them because the compass stands like at 60 degrees with which you can make a triangle which has uh, three sides or three corners so they call this the concept of three which always stand for the compass so here you got the whole family taken hostage by the swiss serial killer thomas nick exactly six years ago by the day and here he isolated the boy and he raped one and he left three they all know it people it's all satanic it's evil it's dark it's from switzerland land and um, the swiss police completely back this all up you know all these things 
So concept of four, four people being held hostage. And here's a concept of three, isolating the little kid, doing all the dirty things and leaving three. The guy who did it, the serial killer, is 100% initiated into Freemasonry. While he was riding the kid like two Templars on one horse and being connected like a USB battery charger to suck up the boy's life energy. He then slit the boy's throat, still being connected, while looking the mother in the eyes, trying to get their souls in a satanic Freemason Templar ritual from Switzerland, land, the land of the Tsar. Statistics prove us that 69% of all serial killers are pinkless killers, being not a surprise that Thomas Nick's lawyer also was a pink list killer, a female pink list killer, defending their community and for them quite normal practices by saying in court that the children, the victims, were also responsible for what had happened. And you can read it here, the serial killer 69% and the rest. Statistics people, facts. And you can see it in this video here on my channel Homeland Sick Security. The Swiss winter solstice serial killer had also traveled all over the US in the years before, which I've shown you already in some other videos that YouTube has taken off on the pressure of the Swissies and probably by the pink list killers working for them who only permit their pink list killer agenda and nothing else, thus contributing a lot in this Nazi Templar dictatorship. A few of the videos can still be seen, like this one here on the same channel, but the very best and most revealing ones are gone. I've got also one in Brighton left, here it says Brighton. And here's the title, YouTube deleted this videos on the pink list killer mafia, their crimes and their alliance with Nazis. Here you can see it. There's my channel on Gure, published three months ago. But as my, the network is very bad here, I, I, it, I, when I get, I go all the time, I get interrupted and thrown out of the, out of the Wi-Fi. So YouTube, you know, it, 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 it retakes, you know, at the same place where you left, you know, but not at Brighton. So I, I cannot go on here, but, um. And this here, Danke Leibacher, Le, uh, Friedrich Leibacher, um, that was just of, uh, after 9-11. He, um, he went into a government building and he whacked about 14 of them. And for some people, he's a hero in Switzerland, like here, the ice hockey guys. For the ice hockey guys, you know, who like to punch on others, like, you know, uh, he's a hero. And all these people, you know, in the Swiss dictatorship, 
they got all thrown into the slammer because of this here. You, you cannot pronounce, there's no liberty of speech at all in Switzerland because it's the, uh, it's the center of the elite where it needs a special sort of inhabitant, you know, the Swiss, who should be very obedient to all laws and everything the newspapers chew you out. And there's one that got saved in Israel on Ahava 528 in French. Here's the title. Police Suisse protège des pédophiles LGBT satanique comme Thomas N. et des enleveurs des enfants. And here you can read about it, what happened in Wikipedia, the Rupertsville murder case, like Jack the Ruper, you know, another Swiss story. <laughs> so it happened on December 21st, 2015. That's today, exactly six years ago, and exactly the same day I had to leave Switzerland. And I did. Uh, the police, instead of terrorizing me and my family that day, they should have been here and protected this family. But the police are only there to protect pedophiles, especially the Swiss police. They're only there to protect drugs, to protect the Swiss banks, for which they lied a lot of things together against me, because I criticized the Swiss bank. Uh, by writing in the Kronenzeitung in Austria and some other international newspapers. Here you can see a gun he was having with him, but he, he used a knife. He, and the, the Swiss, this is a Swiss gun. The Swiss had this in the army until um, even after the war in a, a, in a 32 caliber, that's 7.65. <clears throat> a small caliber, too small without any stopping power, but it makes it a bit lighter, you know. Ah, here it says, the Swiss Army Ordnance Pistol. <clears throat> uh, this one here, it's a Swiss version of the Luger, but in a 32 caliber. Almost like a lady's pistol, if you want. Be careful out there today on winter solstice because they might choose their blood ritual victims randomly, like the Wu flu picks its victims randomly in this huge winter solstice blood ritual of today which is the biggest worldwide winter solstice blood ritual Pharaoh from Switzerland has ever worshipped and absolutely worth the end times scenario with a winter solstice blood ritual on steroids, the biggest serial killer of all times.